I'm going to dive into some huge news from Dash. So they uh, have launched this new payment network called Dash Direct. It's non-custodial, user-controlled retail app, uh, and it's accepted at 155,000 merchants. You can save a ton of money using Dash uh, and just paying for ordinary things that you would ordinary buy, uh, uh, usually buy. It's uh, super interesting. You can get discounts of up to 12%. They have all kinds of uh, people participating in this program, American Eagle, Best by Chili's, Chipotle, CVS, DoorDash, GameStop. I mean, it, it's huge. The reach is awesome. So if you're someone who uses crypto every day, uh, this is probably going to be a great asset to your life. I've definitely seen just amazing positive reviews from people in the community. I know who live on crypto who are already using this and who just are very grateful that it exists. I'm going to throw this straight to Will because I know he has some thoughts and then we're going to put on the fighting gloves and we're going to hash this out, Will. What you got? <laughs> What do I got? I got a lot in the bag. I'm not a fan of oh, any no. coin out there that has decided to put itself into the position to attack Bitcoin purposely. And that's what they just continue to do. So I don't, I don't like anything to do with Dash. I'm just like going to say it out there. They Maybe continue to walk me through that. How are they not attacking sure Bitcoin understand. directly, Will? By providing useful I'm gonna moderate this. services? <laughs> <laughs> we can go through it. We can go through it. The original team... Large pre-mine, held onto the coins. Now they add a lot of integrations for payments. Their money holdings just go up because of that. It's just fiat, but privatized. It's no different. This is totally wrong. Oh my God. Okay, so this is Bitcoin, not at all fiat. This is a decentralized network, Will. So I'm going to push back on this. I'm someone, unlike, <laughs> unlike you, I'm someone who actually uses crypto. So as someone who uses it in the real world, I'm not looking for <laughs> tribalism <laughs> or like what's what the original team did. Like I'm looking for what's useful in my life right now. What gives I'm me that financial sovereignty? Right, me too. But I'm looking for financial sovereignty, something where I can control control my money. Now I can either use my credit card like you do and give the banks all of my financial data and keep empowering the system that I hope to take down one day. Or I can say, well, I'm going to use something that's private. I'm going to use something that gives me back control over my money where I don't need to ask a third party to give me permission to access my own funds. This is something that does that. So people who scoff at it, they're the people who are there using their bank accounts. They're empowering this existing system. I'm not a fan of that. I'm not a fan of, of saying, well, one day, you know, we're going we're gonna to hedge our bets and one day this thing will become useful. No, guys, this day is today. Our privacy is being violated. Our money is being controlled. Our decisions are being censored. And we can actually take back control of that by using other currencies. Heaven forbid you use the taboo word and start to talk about altcoins. But to be honest, like the people who are using this every day find it incredibly useful, regardless of whatever story people say about it, pitting against cryptocurrencies. Yes, let's pit cryptocurrencies against each other. Let's have the best one win. Let's have competition out there. Honestly, Dash is doing a great job by bringing cryptocurrency utility to users, and I'm a huge fan. I think this we kind stand. of shows like the big difference between Bitcoin and the rest of the currencies out there. Bitcoin is trying to operate as like a a sovereign asset of value, and then it'll become it a payment now. network. It is now. All these to. other currencies it used to be are about trying the payment to become networks, payment networks. Right? They're trying to be payment network. Dash great. is no different than fiat. You price everything in fiat, so well, you're just using you're just oh, using the Dash God. network. You're still oh pricing God. in the same way. Bitcoin's Who trying cares, to undergird well? all that. Who cares? I, I can price it in whatever I want and I still have financial sovereignty. So let me price it in whatever's <laughs> most useful to price it. Let me use whatever systems are out there as long as I get financial dash? sovereignty. How, well, I earn my dash. I get donated dash. You know, there, there are lots of different ways I won't disclose on air, but you know, there are so many ways to get cryptocurrency. Crypto. I'm a fan of using crypto. I you should use will, crypto because whenever you, you shut can. Down all the things <laughs> but savings that have is utility. also one way of using your crypto. No, I'm not but, a fan okay, of Dash. I agree. I agree. A hundred percent. Savings is a use for crypto. It's not the only use. And people who are like Bitcoin maximalists seem to think it is the only use. I'm sorry, but there are people out there who want control of their money in all areas of their life, not just for their savings. Like my savings are great, but I believe in the utility and the future of Bitcoin. You know, I am going to be using my Bitcoin now. You know, I'm going to be but having most of my money like in Bitcoin. Practices? I'm not going to be having my savings in fiat. You're establishing bad practices within cryptocurrency by using a coin that has known faults. I use a coin that gives me great utility that's accepted at all the places where it I has, want to do my day-to-day -day so purchases. The dollar has Try great and find utility. me a place. 
Yeah, and it's tracked it's and it's monitored yourself. and it's censored and it's completely controlled by third parties. That's exactly the system that the cypherpunks wanted to take down, Will. And you're out there pretending to be part of this and you're clouded. You've got blinders on and you don't realize you're feeding into the same narrative that is trying to crush payments in cryptocurrency. It's terrible. Dash and Lazar are almost equivalent. There's just a few this differences. Is yeah. This so is no, they're not like Twitter at all because one of them <laughs> is essentially controlled by a central a bank, discount a, a central bank, Eagle. Will, that it completely controls the money we'll supply that's not elected. I elect to choose Dash. You know, I like to choose many other currencies too. Dash is just one of the many that I use. But now it just, you know, picked up a whole bunch of utility through this program, which I'm very excited about. But this, to equate central banks to a private money is crazy to me. This is not some shadowy it's a central company cabal versus a of central bank. It's, well, first of all, it's not a central company. You don't know what you're talking about because you clearly don't know who runs Dash Masternodes. It's a very decentralized system. So you should start, no, you maybe do some more research Dash into that. How did Dash Direct get set up? How did well, Dash Direct get how set, got up? set How did Shapeshift get set up, you know? But they're going completely decentralized. Things evolve, Will. They change. To buy into this narrative that whatever happened years ago, you know, that's the way it's always going to be because it started out from a single person or a single company is ridiculous, you know? We're here to create decentralized systems. We're here to create networks with other people and build teams and then build more, you know, evolve those teams, grow them, decentralize them. I think that this is a great product. And what's more is I can save a ton of money. Not only do I get back financial sovereignty and I don't have to ask a middleman like, hey, PayPal, will you give me permission to get my money out today? I just use it and I save like 12%. I'm going to be saving a ton of money while you're off, you know, using your fiat credit card, getting everything tracked. JP Morgan's going to be hacked again. Your details are going to be out there on the web and I'm going to be here <laughs> being so it. happy with I myself, Will. I'm going to be so happy with myself, <laughs> okay?